developing right now. A Volusia County deputies in the hospital recovering from a serious crash. New pictures from the sheriff's office show what's left of the deputy's motorcycle and the helmet that may have saved his life. Sheriff Mike Chitwood just gave an update on that deputy's condition. New 6's Mark Lehman is at the scene with the latest. Some heart-stopping moments for deputies after learning one of their own was involved in a serious crash that happened here at this intersection this morning after investigators say an SUV drove into the deputy's path. He's a very lucky, very lucky young man. Not too many people survive a head-on collision, motorcycle versus car. Volusia County Sheriff Mike Chitwood says it's nothing short of remarkable that the deputy involved in this crash is alive, something he credits to this motorcycle helmet now bearing the scars of the impact. He's going to walk away from this. He He's hurting, he's in a lot of pain, but boy, it beats the outcome. The crash happening around 7.20 this morning on Saxon Boulevard at Merrimack Lane. According to the Florida Highway Patrol, an SUV made a left turn in front of the deputy's motorcycle. Chitwood says the man behind the wheel is 92 years old. 92 years old, turn right in front of the, of the motorcycle. And, and the deputy, thank God he doesn't remember anything. But from witnesses, there, there was no way to avoid the crash. The deputy seriously hurt in the crash, but is expected to make a full recovery. Chit was saying he expects him to be back in action as soon as possible and is thankful for those who jumped in to help. And thankfully, uh, within seconds of the crash, there was an off-duty Deltona firefighter who happened to be in the area who began first aid on Deputy Ray. Troopers say the driver of the SUV was also taken to the hospital, but with minor injuries, as is the case with most crashes, charges are pending while the investigation continues. In Deltona, Mark Lehman, getting results, News 6.